This video is going to be about Eugenia Cooney, and I'm sure she's going to be watching this, so please listen and please take what I have to say to heart and try to understand where I'm coming from if you can. Uh, Eugenia Cooney and I have known each other somewhat since 2014, I would say, from the app You Now. We would live stream on there and she would live stream on there, and that's how we got to know each other. And we've never been super close friends or anything like that, but we've always been supportive of each other. And that's why, one of the reasons why this has been like kind of an uncomfortable situation for me for a while to address and has been something that's been hard to say. Um, but it's no surprise that she's been struggling um, to all of us, but the only person that can't seem to see that is herself. And it makes her friends and it makes her viewers and it makes everyone feel very lost on what to do. Um, she's a very sweet person. She's a very nice person. Um, I've only met her a few times, but all the experiences have been great. Fortunately, there's always been the struggle that we've seen with her eating disorder, which I know she doesn't address really and if she does she kind of laughs it off it feels like I feel the reason I'm making this video is to try to say what I have to say about it because I feel if I don't then I'm gonna regret it and I feel like I wouldn't have tried this has been going on from my knowledge for about five or so years and it's really hard to watch I don't know what to do I don't know if me liking her photos or being you know like positive online towards her is you know is, is that the right thing to do I think to herself like she doesn't see the problem with what is going on with her um, and that's the really sad reality Eugenia is a very sweet person and she doesn't deserve to be going through what she's been going through. And I wish she would be able to see that these people that are addressing the situation that she's been going through are not just haters and not just people trying to bring her down. I know she has a lot of haters and a lot of people that are insensitive towards the situation that she's been going through and people that will make jokes and that's not okay. And I know she's gotten more hate than almost anyone I've seen online and she does not deserve that. She's one of the last people to deserve anything like that. This has always been like a weird situation for me to want to bring up. I've, I've, I've wanted to talk about this for a while, but I always talk myself out of it. But now it's at the point where I'm just so concerned and I feel helpless. And the one thing I always can go to is my camera and try to say my thoughts. And I know I could probably DM her all this, but we're not that close. And I feel that me talking directly to the camera will be able to show my emotions better on the situation. And maybe she'll be able to listen to this. I want you to understand that it's not just people trying to, you know, include themselves into your life to just judge you and judge everything that you do. That's not what we're trying to do. That's not what people that are actually concerned about you are trying to do, but people do care about you and know that you're a sweet person and a very nice person and you help a lot of people, but the one person you haven't been able to help is yourself. And it's really shitty to see. It's really awful to see. And it's to the point where I don't even know if I can like a video of yours or like a photo because I don't know if that's supporting what you're going through. This isn't about you as a person, but the eating disorder stuff is extremely sad to watch, and I really want you to get better. We all do, I think, and um, you don't deserve this. Whatever you have in your head that's telling you to, that you deserve to be putting yourself through this stuff is a complete lie. I hope you can understand that. I know that like, it's shitty that so many people have to make videos about what's going on and what has been going on for years. It's been like this where people make videos about Eugenia and it's something that's always brought attention to people or brought attention to her. And 
it's shitty because it's nothing's changed. She's still struggling and we can all see it. And it's just played off as, oh, this is just me and that's not okay. And it's teaching people that that's okay. And that's, that's the healthy way to look. And I know she's not telling people to look that way, but people do take it that way. I really hope that you can look in your heart and understand that this is something that is actually happening. We all are seeing it and we all want you to get better. Um, if you want to talk to me anytime, you have my DMs, you have everything. Uh, I will answer anything that you would ever need, but I have no idea what to do at this point And I just felt the need to say something because otherwise I'm just allowing it to happen um, I'm not expecting myself to ever make a video about you again, especially You know talking about the situation. That's not my place, but as a person that's been a, You know a friend of yours, I would say and um, has followed you for years, I feel that there's a responsibility for me to address this. Something needs to change though. This can't keep on happening. We're all extremely worried about you and we want what's best for you. And we want you to take care of yourself. And currently, that's not what's happening. Um, I, I don't really know what else to say besides please understand that people are actually worried about you and it's not just something that people are trying to get involved in your life and tell you how to live but we are worried about your health and i want you to understand that and i i hope you can i couldn't imagine what you're going through i've not been in that situation myself but i'm sending this with love and all that that I wish you the best and I hope that you can find the strength to see what people are saying and hopefully get better because I don't know, it's just, it's concerning. It's really, it's scary. This isn't something that is easy to talk about because it's very sensitive and I feel me saying something about this is, especially on video, is super overwhelming in a sense because she knows me and I know her to an extent, and um, I don't want her to think I'm being a dick, but I'm not being a dick. This is like, it's just the reality. We want you to get better. Please listen to what I have to say. And everyone in the comments, please don't be rude to her. I know like people are always rude to her and that's not the way, that's not gonna, that's not gonna make anything better. There's no point of dragging her down, that's not, gonna help her and that's not gonna help anything that's gross to do um, but it is okay to be concerned and that's how I am and uh, I think a lot of us are and I just wish her the best and please just understand that it's okay to get help and um, people care about you and we want to see you strive and we want you to live a long life and a positive life and have everything that you deserve and it's that's that's pretty much it um so yeah uh i don't know um thanks for watching though i wish you the best i hope you took to heart what i had to say and um Peace and love to you.